Yo, what's going on, Night Family? Welcome back to another video, guys. Welcome back to another vlog. Hey, about to do a couple of Instacart orders, do like three of them things. Uh, I'm only gonna vlog one of them and just knock out the rest of the two. Right now, I'm heading to the Instacart, not Instacart, I'm heading to the Kroger's on Tate's Creek right now. And it's still snowing the ground from what? Still snowing the ground from three days ago, literally, three days ago. <clears throat> Last time it snowed, three days ago. Supposed to get some rain coming through on Wednesday. Today is Tuesday. So, God damn that sun bright, boy. That thing beaming, God. Woo! Arr, arr, arr. That ain't beaming, boy. But, hey, dude, I just love the feel of the cold weather. I just love the feel of the, the winter time, you know? Like, it just looks nice and beautiful outside, man. I'm not sure if you guys like cold weather or not. But the cold weather and the snow on the ground just give you that Midwestern feel, you know? It just give you that vibes, you know? Even though I'm in Kentucky, hey, your boy feel like he in the Midwest. You know, they still tatted on no shirt, drop top in the middle of the one. I'm geek. They still tatted on God damn, got the bitch. I'm a D. Whoa, whoa, whoa. But hey, dude, about to head to Kroger's. I'll catch you guys when I'm head walking there. This is my favorite Kroger's to go to. This is my go to Kroger's. Honestly, it is. The sun is bright as hell off this road. That's one thing I don't like about it when it when it snows. The sun be bright as hell, bro. But hey, when I get to the Kroger's, I pick it up, show you guys how to do it. You feel me, eh? If you guys want to do it by Instacart, I highly recommend Instacart as a secondary job. If you guys want to hustle a little extra 100 to 200 bucks. If you want to have an extra 100 to 200 bucks every two weeks, Instacart is the thing for you. you know? I honestly average between 200 bucks every week. I make $100 a day off Instacart. I do it for like five, six hours if I want to. On my off days. Sometimes I do like two or three orders just to have an extra little 40, 60 bucks in my pocket, you know? You can easily average 100 to 200 bucks every week for Instacart. You can do it when you get off work. You can do it whenever, you know? That's one cool thing about Instacart. So, hey, let me get in this bitch and let's get it going. You feel me? All right, guys, I just pulled up at Takes Creeks and Takes Creek Kroger's. Right now, this batch is literally like $9 for five items. They don't live that far, so it's an easy little batch. Take my little ass in here, shop these five items so these customers won't. Hey, uh, what the fuck? Chicken crab salad. Spicy. Oh, shit. They want a lot of things. I got to put this together for them. But right now, dude, still cold as hell outside. Should warm up. So this is a quick little order, quick little batch. I'm going to knock out the way. Get this taken care of. So let's get to it. All right, guys. Your boy about to make a little... This little sandwich right here real quick, 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 quick. So how you do? I want to talk to you guys about something crazy that happened between me, my co-worker and stuff like that, you know? So right now, I was doing my Instacart. I just, I, I got finished doing Instacart like two hours ago. It's like, what, it's three o'clock? Started at nine o'clock, did like three orders, made like 70 some bucks today. Knocked it out the way. But first thing I like to talk about is how my store manager hit me up out of nowhere trying to get on me for some bull crap, you know? Like, it was a 12-year-old kid came into the store looking for some art supports, some footworks type stuff like that. And I felt like I made the right decision. Honestly, I mean, I felt like I made the right financial best decision, also beneficial decision for the 12-year-old. Kids, like, we're a size 9 as a 12. Guys, the kid said, don't hurt his foot. I got him with a $2,000 worth of product. And he's talking about thinking selfishly. I wasn't thinking selfishly. I never think selfishly. I always think about how I make money and how I'm gonna help somebody else. I always about, like everything about sales comes from a win-win situation. It has to be you winning and I'm winning. Simple as that. So me in this position of a wellness specialist, AKA art support specialist, I honestly care about helping these people out. Dude. I'm not just trying to put them in some bull crap that make me some money, you know? I helped this kid out, I talked to the parents, told them how this is going to be a smart investment. Of my knowledge of the company, they always said they can bring it back a month from now, six months from now, eight months from now, 10 months from now, 30 years from now, stuff like that. And you get a rejection and get you a new one. I was always told that, but buddy over here talking about some, he can't bring it back and they won't honor it because he's 12 years old. How is it? I was never told that you could only sell this to kids and you could only sell this to adults. I know we got a kid selection, but at the same time, if you got a kid wear a size 12 shoe, you're not going to get him in some little ass kid like art supports. You're not. You're not. A kid wear a size 10 shoe. What the hell is a hug going to do? 
Guys, this thing is like gel-like substance. It's flexible, bendable, and the kid literally needs to feel something to help out his arches. And the guy talking about some, uh, it's going to hurt his, his uh, foot growth or something like that. The product that I, that we have is not even much pliable to mess with the plates in your feet. It's, it progress, it, helps, it, it literally changes your feet very slowly that you cannot notice it until you last like six months or so, you know? This kid is not going to grow rapidly. Even though he's 12 years old, he's not going to grow every single day. His feet just going to keep expanding. I am 20 years. I am, in, I, am in my, I, I am in my 20s right now, guys. And my foot been a size 8 ever since I was in middle school. I got some shoes that I had since the 7th grade and I can still wear them perfectly fine. Not all people like me. Not all people like me, you know. But more of the story, I feel like I made the right decision. I deserve apology for it. I looked, for, I looked out for the guy financially because... The product that he wanted to put him in, a kid's thing, he's going to be spending 400 bucks out the store every six months. 400 bucks out the store if anything happens to that product. So he's going to be way out of $2,000 from the age of 12 to 18. That's more than $2,000 every six months. Come on now. I'm helping people out. That's what I signed up for. Uh, like, like, at least tell me what's going on, you know? Like, at least tell me, like, the reason why my hair look like this, guys, I washed my hair and I just had a game. I was playing a game. But tell me directly this is for kids these are only for adults you cannot bring it back every single time you need a new one you can bring it back every year somebody talk to me it's weird i need to clean up my i cleaned up my uh clean this up you know camera kind of jittery don't know why it's jittery probably low lighting gotta fix that don't know why but hey man i just want to talk to you guys and rent sorry all right guys it is literally the next day honestly after that little talk I had with you guys, I literally sat down, didn't do nothing all day, didn't even go to the gym, felt lazy, and didn't feel like doing much, you know? But how you do? Today's the next day, and I'm up here at this apartment complex right now, about to get a little tour of the apartment complex. I'm going to get this fixed. I promise you guys, I'm going to get this fixed, you know? And, hey, let me check out the, uh, let me check out just the focus effect real quick, make sure it's, it's fixed. Yep. All right, my camera's still good. So, I'm going to check out these apartments. These are nice-looking apartments. Still looking for my mom and still looking for me as well. My sister's still trying to figure out what she's going to do. She might move move out with my mom so they can share an apartment and I can have my own place. Or is this going to be, I don't know, man. It's a cluster right now. We're going to figure something out. So I'm going to get up in here and get things figured out. So, hey, let's get to it. All right, guys. So we just made it into the apartments. Other people in here. So I'm not going to try to like put the video up in front of them, around them. So that's kind of weird. want to respect other people's space. Go ahead. I'm going to turn this to wide angle lens for you guys to see more. So right now as you walk in, this is the bathroom right here. It's pretty spacious. Got like a little weird tub, you know. I ran into more apartments that look a lot better than this. This one is kind of small. This one is kind of small. This is real small. <laughs> for the price and the size, you got way more different than this. So that's about it. So the kitchen is literally a straight shoot through there. <laughs> yeah, this is a no for me. <laughs> this is a no. Too small. But look at the lights. Look at the YouTube. Oh, oh, oh. Flicking it up and shit. You know? These apartments are no for me. It's a no. I can't do it. It's weird looking. Apartment complex look nice on the outside, but very small on the inside. Side looks. Nice little, nice little spot. <clears throat> like a decent sized refrigerator. Good hmm. Got a little pantry right here.
It's probably need to change the battery. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, my table will fit in this little area. Pretty nice. <clears throat> Watch the little bathtub. All right, guys, your boy done made it up to the fucking gym, LAC, Lexington Athletic Club, and I'm about to get me a nice-ass arm day in, work out the arms, work out the shoulders a little bit, type stuff like that, you know? So, all right, man, so here's my gym. Why the hell do I got this thing in wide? Here it goes. Yeah, man, going in here, she got my little workout, do some arms, pump it out. Mostly, I'm gonna focus on the day is shoulders and triceps, because your boy's slacking her nose. The bicep is looking decent, but the triceps and shoulders kind of weak, you know? So, hey, let me get in here, get this workout started, so let's get to it.
great guys your boy just got put his working out did a couple arms shoulders did a little back did record that but it's no i'm gonna start doing back every single day because your boy back is literally kind of skinny so i'm trying to improve all that but hey i'm about to wrap up today's vlog for these guys if you guys did for yourself enjoy today's video thumbs it up subscribe to the channel if you're new to the channel want to see more videos from me just make sure you hit that subscribe button i got you guys content dropping damn near every single day i can say that if i miss a day it's probably one day if not hey and i see that i got a lot of people coming in lexington and subscribing to the channel hey I tell your friends about me share the video around the web and might play a little basketball if people show up at the jail it's a little court right there that's about it but hey man i'll catch you guys later i'm out peace